Hey, my name is Nicolette Lewis. I am taking a class in families and um, I, my job description or title that I researched in was in a adoption agency counselor. I founded an organization that is an independent organization which is called the Independent Adoption Center which is located on Century Boulevard Suite 1450 um, as well as their address number is 5777 in Los Angeles, California. Um, I found this um, adoption agency years ago. I had a lot of families that were going through a lot of adoptions in my, at my church, and a lot of them actually went to this adoption center. It's one of the hubs that a lot of people go to, as well as to finding children. So what is an adoption agency counselor? Adoption agency counselors are those that help families who are wanting to adopt children, as well as fostering children and helping mothers um, who are giving up their child for adoption. And so it can be a happy and sad time for those times. Um, it's important at this time, you usually, with this job, you usually work with the federal state laws as well as the state and trying to deal with paperwork as well as attorneys, trying to fill out all the, the paperwork that needs to be filled out in order to legally adopt a child. Um, you will, um, there are many typical stressors that I encounter with the job. It's a very high stressful environment, especially for those who are dealing with uh, birth mothers, since they will be giving up a child, so you need to help them cope as well as taking out children's children from their homes is to, into a new family home, especially when they're abused or neglected. You also can have to deal with family loss and coping, as well as happy families that are wanting to adopt children. But there are typical benefits. Um, it depends if you're working for an independent company or a, um, through the state. When you work for an independent company, you deal with just a regular business, you know, you get insurance, benefits, vacation time, days off, typical things. Whereas if you work up in the state, you get 401k already paid for, you get insurance paid for, you get vacation time off and everything. You get the state benefits. Um, and the typical benefit is that you get to see happiness in these and success in these children's lives and having a good change and a positive change in this person's lives as well as for those who are parents as well as children. So what are the common tasks that you encounter? You're helping the uh, many different aspects when it comes to adoption, whether it's paperwork, parents, mothers, children, whatever it is, you're helping the, the mothers who are deciding do they want to do adoption or do they not want to do adoption. They also are to help decide the families and which parent to choose with, and you have to deal with all the paperwork so that as well as the families to advertise themselves and say, we want a baby and whatnot. So, and you're also helping mothers to cope as they give up their child. And it's really hard for a lot of moms because you start to bond that relationship. So it's really important that you avoid it. But not only are you dealing with birth mothers, um, you also deal with uh, families that are giving up adoption later on in the child's lives, uh, whether they're 10 years old or 16 years old or whatever. So it can be a hard time at the same time. So it just depends on where the child's life is at that point. So what are the educational requirements? You are to, Most, um, I have found, uh, depends on what degree you have, but there's a lot of states that do small and big, and if you're in a big city, it's more likely that they more likely would like to have a master's degree, or at the least a bachelor's degree. You need to have training on how to deal with coping, not only that, but dealing with children that are being abused or being neglected. You need to learn how to handle those kinds of situations. So in California, obviously our incomes are a little bit higher because it's much of a higher rate instead of living in a small town where things are much cheaper. Um, so the starting range is at $45,000 a year and the experience starting range is around $70,000 a year. It depends on if you're working with the state or if you're working with um, independent company. So if you work with independent, you're more likely to get higher paid, whereas the state is more standardized. 
So, and you know, there will be many things that you'll encounter with the job. And the most important part is bringing families together. And that's the best part about the job is you're able to see those happy times and love and excitement. And there will be times where it'd be hard and you will encounter children that have been abused and you will need to know how to react to those kind of situations. Overall, this career is actually a really fun career. It, it can be stressful, but at the same time, you will get to enjoy it and to you'll get to see the light in their lives and to be able to change a person's life. And um, I hope you enjoyed my little post. And uh, maybe if you're ever interested in adoption um, agency centers or everywhere around the world, there's no, you know, it's easily to be found. So thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video.